Hello and welcome to this video on IBM Cognos Theme Designer. Theme Designer was introduced with Cognos 1021, however it is not supported by IBM. Theme Designer allows users to create custom styles or skins for your Cognos Connection portal. This is usually appropriate when you want to create a corporate look and feel for your Cognos environment. The installation process is very simple and there are two parts. Firstly, Theme Designer contains two folders that need to be copied over top of the VERS and Web Content directories within your Cognos installation directory. Secondly, .json extensions need to be allowed within IIS. Once this has been done, Theme Designer is available for use. This video will take you through creating a custom style and publishing it to our environment. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is navigate to Theme Designer. Um, the URL that's specified in the documentation is actually incorrect and the URL shown at the bottom of the screen currently is the URL that needs to be used. The documentation says to use the server name slash alias slash Theme Designer, but you actually need to put um, specify explicitly the gateway on the end of that in order to get it to work. So once we're in Theme Designer, this is the splash screen. Um, we can open up an existing or create a new. So I'm going to create a new one and base it off contemporary. The skin can take a little while to come up, but there we go. And we've got two tabs to customize at the top and these are all the different sections of the style or the skin that needs customizing. Now when you hover over um, the colors it flashes. It can be quite difficult to see what needs to be customized. So if you look at this text just in the background here as I hover over it you can see it to start to flash between the green and the orange and again if I'm hovering over the white then we can see the background. We've got banner section and we can specify logos here, custom pages, grids, navigation pane, dialogues, tabs, toolbars and menus. So let's just start off with um, the background color. So maybe set it to a nice blue and the links color maybe to a white. And we can click on banner. We can see again that it's the log on section that's flashing. So I want a whitish color title color I'm going to go for black and we can set a gradient on this or specify an image so I'm going to specify a couple of different types of blue and you can see now we're starting to build up our own custom design now I'm not going to run through all of these options but once we're satisfied with what we've produced what we can do is save as, give it a name such as company, okay that, wait for it to be saved, save as complete. We can download it and this is for if you've got multiple gateways then that file can then be copied across to your multiple gateways and once we've done that we just publish it up to IBM Cognos Connection. So what I'm going to do now is navigate back to Cognos Connection and go to my preferences and select one that I've actually created earlier which is my company and it's 
So this is the splash screen that created. We've got our logo embedded and our title set. And again, if we go there, we've got our logo in there and uh, heading up here. So it's quite easy to do, a lot easier than it was previously when you had to edit the style sheet directly. Thank you for watching this video on Theme Designer. For more information, contact sales at triangleinformationmanagement.com or visit us at triangleinformationmanagement.com.